online and we're at the Limes at Huntington in Cannock in Staffordshire and we're here with Barrett Holmes and we're here to see the Cambridge house type. The Cambridge is a four bedroom detached house. You can see here a beautiful detached house, double garage on this particular block where you can see that lovely barrack detail you've got, a really nice tile porch there, a tile bay window there and what makes Barrett really special is that lovely differential brickwork around the uh, around the windows just give it just something a little bit different and um, without further ado let's go and take a look hi hello hi Emma gosh what Boy. a beautiful day to be looking at show homes. house type is this is the four bedroomed Cambridge by Barrett Homes yeah we've got a few of the Cambridges on from a few places all over the country we so have, nice yes. to see another we one isn't there different elevations and yeah, different diff decor and it's yes. nice to give you guys a bit of variety it certainly is righto are we to plan no we're back to front right i think we'll start this side then with the study nice little room in there Just dimensions are two meters two by two meters one according to that it's december the 22nd mm. well, i think it's a bit warm for december i'm glad the warm weather has come back again i don't i don't like it Got three clocks there as well. Yeah. Okay. Here in the. Um, but they all say London on them. Yeah, and they've all stopped. Yeah, all the different places. Okay. So next to the front door, then you've got a little. Yeah, cupboard. I like this little broom cupboard. I do. I think it's a coat cupboard, isn't it? Broom cupboard. You can put your broom in there. Yeah. If you've got a bit. And broom. you've got the plug sockets in there. Let's come on. Let's. Have a look, we've got some plug sockets going on there, telephone socket. Yeah, there's so a modem. Socket for your plug-in Yeah, or your modem. Absolutely, yes, your router or your modem. A router. Right, we've got a door here. Yeah. That's your downstairs WC, internal. Yeah, nice and cool in here as well. That's because there's no window. Yeah, very nice, isn't it? Which way shall we go? Let's go back and into the living room then. Oh, lovely. Okay. So we've got a bay at the front. Dimensions for this lounge are 5 metres in length by 3 metres 7 in width. Look at that. You've got the Bay of San Francisco. I can see that it's been a very busy day. It in has the in the show. So you've got the today. Bay of San Francisco and now you've got the Bay of the Link of the Cambridge. Cambridge. Beautiful ceiling to floor curtains there. So they've got two sofas, two chairs in the bay, big piece of furniture, very, very big coffee table. Why is it always when I go in show homes, the TV always looks like it's leaning? Mm. Well, because <laughs> it's not real. <laughs> There's no weight in it, is there? No, it's just plastic. Yeah, good, good room though. Yes. I've got a duck there. I've got a duck by the TV. They've got a pineapple by the TV. A duck and a pineapple. You see that big pineapple? It's beautiful. Yeah. So then, this leads us through into the dining room. Dimensions are 3 metres 2 by 2 metres 6. And also, with French doors there, over onto that lovely patio in the garden. I've actually got a spider hanging from my camera. Have you? Look at that. Oh, yeah. Look at that, guys. 
He's been hitching a ride on my on my gimbal for ages. So, in this beautiful Does it look familiar now? Kitchen breakfast family, yes, I do remember yeah. it. Yes, you have to forgive me. We see so many show homes that yeah. sometimes I just I can't remember all the detail. I try to. This is lovely, isn't it? So they've got a breakfast area in here, again with another telly, and a couple of chairs there. I suppose you could use it in any way you wanted, couldn't you? You yeah. could have that as your main dining area, you could have a sofa it's, in it's here. It's open plan almost, very, apart very from this little bit. Yeah, well, there isn't a door there, is no. there, essentially? It's a kind of, it's a walk yeah. through into the kitchen. Well, now we've got another London clock, so that counts, another that's clock. three clocks. Yeah. Now, I always say with Barrett Homes, and they put the sign up, it's saying that, please be aware that this is the show home. It has been dressed to show viewers what's on offer. So what's in here may not be available or it may be an upgrade yeah. and you have to ask about it. Okay, I'll just first of all I just want to point out right. So we've got we've got doubles of everything kind of going on here. So we've got multiple clocks. We've got two signs there as well, haven't we? That say the same thing. Yeah, hang on, there's something going on here. There's two of this look two of those. Mm -hmm. Two signs. Hmm. But there are three show homes. So what's that all about? Right, so let's take a look what's involved then. I'm going to keep the eye on that, I think. I'm looking for two. A fully fitted kitchen. Yeah. There is a wine cooler. Now, that will be an upgrade, won't yeah. it, I would think. Um, lots and lots of cupboard space underneath. You've got an integrated dishwasher. I do love this beautiful work surface. It is lovely. Oh, and unfortunately, this tap's no longer available. What, that tap? That's a really nice tap, well, look, isn't it? look, look. You can okay. almost just take that tap off and put there your you own it's tap one of on. There isn't it? Yes. Fine, yeah. You're fine. What a shame. I'd like a tap like that. Very nice. Anyway, so you've got... Is only that tap any good for washing lettuce? Or shut cupboards. <laughs> I don't like them, because I think they're going to snap my fingers in. Lovely gas hob there, yeah. actually. With that big burner in the middle, that's good for your wok. I like that. Let me give you a little zoom around. Yes. Right. This will be fridge and freezer. If I can get them open. There we go. And then you've got some big drawers here for your pans and various other bits and pieces. And so your oven and grill is underneath. Ah, the Lincoln in there. Ah, okay. So this is your utility. It hasn't got a door on it. So you've got space for... I think there's space for two appliances. Yeah, so we've got the boiler there. We've yeah. got the boiler. Nice little cupboard there as well. Cupboard space. Yeah. I mean, they've got they've got a cupboard there, but I would say you could have another appliance there if you wanted a separate washer and dryer. Yeah. You could, because there isn't a sink. No. So you could have both. Yeah. You've got your door there as well to the rear garden, if you want to show the viewers. There you go. So you just, I just don't turn around quick yeah, enough. See, it. Emma talks quick, and I... I've got to kind of turn well, around. Well, just with pan her. around and show them. Well, there's another door there beautiful for them. This is. I'll open this door then. Oh, it's your. This is your broom cupboard. There you go. Look, mop um, in there. Um, you're telling me to have a pan around. Here you go. Look at this. I'm panning at the moment. And what I want to know is how many people have got one of these. Oh yeah. A feather duster. I can safely say that I haven't. I'll get you one if you want one. But it's one. very nice. That's my new, That's the next Valentine's yes. Day present. So, yeah, there's the mops, there's your broom yeah. cupboard. Okay. So you can actually walk in a complete circle in this house, yeah. right the way around yeah, right. it. Have we yes. done the toilet? Yes, we yes, have. Yes, we have, yeah. Okay. So, let's take a look upstairs. Okay, so first floor then. I think we'll go around that way first, and we'll start with bedroom two. There's quite a big landing. It is. So, back around to the front of the house, we're over the lounge here. And they dressed it as a twin room. Ooh, with a polar bear. Very nice, isn't it? They've got fit a bank of fitted wardrobes there across that wall. Very, very nice. Dimensions. Four metres three by three metres two. Yeah. There's, 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 a, there's a cat in a timber framed house. Look guys. I think it's a skunk. Oh, is it? Mm. That's something you don't see every day. There's definitely a, a two theme in this house. Okay, so we've got a double 
double door cupboard here on the landing so it's but got your cylinder you could easily get a good joiner in there to put you some shelves in yeah, there that could be a super airing cupboard yeah, wouldn't it? definitely okay then at the back here you've got bedroom three with the stalk on the wall pretty just trying to think of the theme in this house hmm we've got birds we've got nature yeah i mean obviously we're in canuck and canuck chase is just on the yeah. on the uh Maybe there isn't a theme as such. Maybe I, we just, I'm just thinking about it too hard. Yeah. Ooh, imagine changing the bulbs in that. Mm. We had somebody say today how complicated light fittings are becoming. <laughs> Dimensions for this room are three metres, three by three metres. But one. look at these lovely swan lamps. Aren't they nice? They are. So here you've got your main bathroom. Bedroom three. So they've got a little dressing table into there as well now. Dimensions for bedroom three are three metres three by three metres one. And it's got a fitted wardrobe as well. And it's a double bedroom with a double bed. Yeah. So in actual fact, you have four double bedrooms in this house because I know the one bedroom has got twin beds, but it's certainly big enough yeah. for a big for a double bed or bigger even. And then you have the two bedrooms at the rear, both with double beds. So this is your master bedroom here with an ensuite then. Back at the front of the house, three metres eight by three metres five. Nicely dressed, isn't it? Two again. We have two gloves. I don't think that's intentional. Maybe it is, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Mm, I think there's something about I don't know. Twos here. Anyway, so we here we've got a little. Uh, well, you would need two gloves because we've all got two hands. Most of us have anyway. Okay, I'm trying to turn the lights on in the ensuite, but that is the lights. That is. That's the one in the shower cube because I think that's the others that aren't working at the moment. That is a really nice effect on those tiles. Look, they're very nice, aren't they? Yeah, I'd say subtle. That in is. actual fact, then this is an internal ensuite, yes. so there isn't a window in here. Let me just reverse out a bit. Beep, beep, beep. Yeah. Okay, we've got a little sit down now. I'll sit down. Oh, that's the end of our show, Holmes, yes. for one day. Anyway, and so what do you think of the Barrett Cambridge? We'd like to know. What do you think of this house? We think it's pretty nice. I think Barrett know a thing or two about creating family mm. houses. Um, you know, and they've been doing it a long, long time, haven't they? They have. Um, but I mean, anyway, let us know, are you buying a Barrett house? What do you think of this house type or any Barrett house type? Give us a thumbs up if you like it. Don't forget to subscribe. And if you need any additional information, check the description box below because it'll all be in there. Room dimensions, prices, location, everything you need to know about this development. You know, in Canucks, a great place, yeah. a great place to live. You know, this is right on the the fringe, the northern fringe of Canuck, mm -hmm. and it's a really, really good site. You know, in Canuck, it's got a great town centre. Canuck you know. is very well located, isn't it? For, yeah. For for everything, for the West Midlands, for Wolverhampton, yeah. for Telford. And not Canuck to mention Chase. the amazing, yeah, the amazing Canuck Chase, mm -hmm. that lovely it's park. Fantastic. Yeah. Anyway, or on your doorstep. But thanks for watching, and we will catch you soon on our next video. Bye. Thank you.